Well, this is Coda Territory's first major storm of the winter. And once it finally passes out of the area, homeowners and business owners will be breaking out the shovels and snow blowers to clean up that snow. According to a Rapid City ordinance, you have 24 hours after a storm to remove snow and ice from sidewalks adjacent to or in front of your property, as well as other areas that could possibly be accessed by the public. Now, if you don't, the city's code enforcement office says there could be consequences and fines. What happens, generally speaking, is if people do not clear their sidewalks off, we'll have it cleared for them. Uh, but then that means that uh, we're going to pay someone and then it's going to be um, charged to the homeowner. It's, it's amazing how many injuries we get uh, from people falling and slipping on the ice and snow. So please, I just implore you to keep your, your sidewalks clear of, um, of snow and ice. Some people are waiting for that deadline. They're getting out today to make sure the sidewalks in front of their businesses are safe and welcoming. We want it safe. We don't want anybody to fall, um, especially getting into their vehicles. And we don't want anyone to have an excuse not to shop downtown. So we've got to keep the sidewalks clear so people feel comfortable to get out and about. The city of Spearfish also follows the same guidelines, but residents there have up to 48 hours to remove the snow.